Hello folks, I'm App Builder and welcome to this series of fabric mods you should absolutely try out. If you need to know how to install fabric and fabric mods, then I'll link to that video in the description below. Today's mod is Librarian Trade Finder by Greenman999. It has just over 2000 downloads on Modrinth, but it should be way, way more because this mod is awesome. So with this mod, you can automate the task of finding the trades you want. Let's check it out. So in scenario one, we have no villagers in our imaginary trading hall over there. So that means there are a whole bunch of enchantments that we want to find. Nice and simple in this mod. We have our lectern, we have our villager, we have in our inventory a whole bunch of lecterns because they fly off in random directions, and we have an ax as well. First thing we want to do is hit the T key then forward slash trade finder and then we want to do space config and hit enter leave that as default go to list enchantments and select the ones that you want now i'm going to select efficiency five feather fall in four and protection four they are all trades i like early game hit those save changes click done okay next step got our librarian got our lectern let's hit the t key let's do trade finder this time we want to do select Everything is good, it'll come up green, your lectern's down, and the librarian is in range. Most common problem is the librarian's just a little bit too far away, nudge him towards the lectern. So with that done, we can then do the T key, do trade finder, and then do search list and hit enter. And as you'll see, it will now start automatically breaking. <laughs> and that was so, so quick. It broke the trade two times and it found protection for for 30 emeralds that was amazingly quick there we go and perfect so what we could do now is if we do that search list again uh sorry go back to config go into the enchantments like this and we got protection four didn't we so you would just save the changes click done go here to villager number two and then do select perfect we found one and then we want to do search list. This time he's only searching for two possible trades. So this could take a little while. We're already on attempt seven, eight, nine, and this will keep going until it finds another trade. Not too bad, 17 attempts, and it found Feather Falling 4 for 41 emeralds. You see how powerful this mod is. But there is another way that you can do searches as well, particularly if you're concerned about the cost of books. Let's check that out. So in scenario number two, let's say emeralds matter and you haven't got the potions of weakness, you haven't got the golden apples yet. So you wanna get these books as cheap as possible. You can also do that. So this time what we're gonna do is open up that chat and do trade finder. We're gonna do select, oops, uh, select, there we go. Make sure we got him selected. And then we're gonna do same again, but trade finder. And this time we're gonna do search single. We're gonna select mending. Don't do what I did and select a price that it can't possibly get. I tried eight before, I believe 10 is the minimum. So we'll try something like 15 for the max price. What that means is it's gonna start searching for mending. If it finds mending, but it's 16 emeralds, it's gonna ignore it and continue. We'll hit enter there and then it should start breaking. We're on attempt number four. This may take a while, so I'll just pause the video and then resume when we've got it. So the best part, 10 minutes later and 625 attempts, I believe, and this fella has mending for 10 emeralds. The lesson here is don't be too aggressive with the prices that you want for your books. You're probably better off just doing the search for list and putting up with whatever you've got and then using the, the zombie convert mechanism to get them cheaper that way. I'd just like to say thank you to Carnage who recommended this mod to me. If there is a mod you think I should feature in this series, let me know in the comments below. And if you enjoyed the video, hit the like button, consider subscribing. And if you're after Lightmatics, then don't forget to go check out abfielder.com. Anyway, folks, that's all I have time for today. I'm Abfielder. Goodbye.